Oh, finally, finally, you bring me in. Obviously, there been so many people in the comedy world. Look, what about? Was oh, what's that with you, bro? So you, you clear, you absorb about this. You ain't got nothing to do with this. Uh, this ain't your fight. This ain't your thing. But listen, shake it. Shake it. What's up? That's why I was trying to come in earlier because the things that were said about me, it, that it, it didn't happen like that. You feel me? And so I just wanted to be all the way cleared out the situation because I wasn't there. And it's unfair to me. You feel me? It's unfair to me that I've been drugged through this and my name was brought up all day to day. If it's about look, if, if if it's about if it's about her getting raped by him, then all the stuff that he said about me today and all the stuff she said about me today wasn't supposed to be happening. He's supposed to be on here like he did defending himself and she's You feel what I'm saying? So no it was the uh, dog. So you wasn't there. We understand. There. And it was supposed to be, and it was an attempted rape, not an actual rape. Correct. So let's clear that. Bitch, they, it was an attempted rape. Bitch, they went back to the childhood days. They played catch, catch, get a little bit. She fell on purpose. <laughs> and that's way. So what? So this, but I'm going to say out of you. The part that was perturbing to me was that, so you contacted her, correct? I called her before all this went night. down. Me, me and Charlie always talk. Oh, I just don't say nothing because of the dude she messed with be giving her money. So I just say I'm not going to expose her like that because I'm going to let her get her hustle on. You know, she was like, you know, that he, every time she need money. And like, that's my baby mama. That's her hustle. It is what it is. So I'm not going to say, oh, Charlie with me. I don't want to play them games no more. Fuck, she got to get her money. And that's how she get her money from the dude. Okay. Yeah, from the dude. So she don't sell her no more? No. So okay, I understand. So so you was talking to her. Did how did she, did she? So she gave to you the knowledge of what she felt in her mind had just happened, correct? Right. And you said, and so the, the part that she alleges that she said you was trying to get some type of sex sexual um that you solicited sex from her at that point that never happened. And yo, and, and your no, that did that did happen, but that was laid on down the line. That that wasn't immediately shaky. Like the, the conversation, let me tell you, the way me and Trelly, we set up, even though we are apart, we still have that that mutual feelings for each other. So basically, we say things that we say. You feel me? What I said to her that night wasn't no different than I, what I said from any other night. You see what I'm saying? And so did you, the way did you think she was? Did, the story changed, and that's when I changed on her. When the story changed, that's when I changed. So at, when she was saying what she was saying at first, I was with her. You know, I was like, Fred, you need to call her. Like, I was just being real nice about the situation to everybody. I didn't even tell Ro. I just kept calling Fred. I called all his people. I said, this is what she's saying. You need to call her. That's all I was doing. Shaky, I wouldn't, nothing more, nothing less. You feel what I'm saying? And, Do you and, think and she was... was did you take her seriously when she told that to you? Or did you yeah. think that maybe she misunderstood what was happening? Or what did you think at that point? No, in the beginning, I believed her. In the beginning. Oh. I believed her in the beginning. Because how she was talking on the phone. She was all hysterical. Like, it, 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 it's, you wouldn't believe what the fuck they just tried to do. Them nasty bitches, like, you know, she was on that kick. So she ain't come down until she got home. She got around her mama because she said, I don't want my mama to know. So that's the first thing that fucked me up. Because when you told the whole world I kidnapped you, like all the stuff that happened with me and you, you put it out there. But now he raped you and you, you don't want nobody to know. So that's the first thing that fucked with me. You feel me? And so then she was like, well, don't tell my sister. So I'm like, why? How could you sabotage me? How could you put me out there on the bag, on the low like that? But yet somebody did something harmful to you. You feel what I'm saying? And so that's, that's what it was. So at that point, so did you advise her to talk to her mom? Did you say, look, look, you need to talk to your mom? Or did you advise her to talk I, to somebody? I did. That was the right thing to do. Yep. I said, tell your mama. I say, but I need to call Fred because I want him to call you because you need to know where his mind was. You see what I'm saying? You know how you was the victim. Shake it. You said you, yeah. said you got raped. So I, you know how I play. You know how I play with you mentally. You feel me? You know how I play is mentally. So... At that time, she was playing on my feelings. And so I'm trying to say, well, why you don't want nobody to know? 
That's my, that was what's killing me. I, 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 anything else changing, I'm cool with. But the fact that you say you're not going to call the police, you don't want your mama to know, that fucked me up mentally. Because I'm like, wait, well, why are you telling me? You see? In that case, um, you only want to talk to somebody you trust. Because you don't want the world to know. You're embarrassed by this. You don't know how to feel. And somebody right. going through it. So I can understand that aspect. But you want to talk to somebody that you can trust at that point. Because you don't feel like you can trust nobody. Correct. And so by her telling you, but she trusted you. So your response at the time she trusted you was, would you give me some pussy? Wait, let me address this. Let me address this real quick. Somebody said, I'm making this about me. No, they're making it about me. I never say nothing. What I'm just telling y'all from the phone calls that I say I shouldn't be in it. So I'm not saying nothing. We, I'm answering shaky questions. Oh, no, hey, go ahead, shake. Yeah. Go ahead, go ahead. So, all right. So when she entrusted you with this information, you advised her to talk to your mama. You tried Correct. to talk to Fred. What, at what part in this did you say, well, what's up? Can I get some? Is that, wait, wait, what part did that come in? Because that I'm was just, about, no, that was, that was like, Eight nine in the morning when she said she's not going inside, so I said, "Come by me." Hey, that was it was long over with, shaky. I never play on. She know how. She know how it is. I never do that. Remember, that's the same girl I I wanted to marry. She know that. It's just the way she told it to y'all. As if soon she told me, no. If somebody tell, what's up, Melinda? I see you, baby. If somebody tell you something like that, you're not thinking like that. But a, as the story start to change, time start to change. She said she's not telling nobody. That's when I say what I see because the story changed. You okay. see what I'm saying? Gotcha. And so that's what it was. So there was a point that you did believe her, and then exactly. it turned yep. up, and it turned to a point that you did not believe her. How long from the time you believed her to the time you didn't believe her? About a good. I want to say it was about four hours. It was a good four hours. Okay. It was yeah. It was definitely it was a good four hours. Is that what book? So that's okay. Crazy. So for so the, for the four hours that you was um. Believe in her. You was advising her. And that's not during that time period that you was like, oh, can I get some? It was at that no, time period you was trying no, to No, because I, I wanted to know what happened. I was I was curious like a motherfucker. How long curious. how long before the four hours elapsed did you actually take it to the media? If you did not believe it, why was it brought I took I, it to the media three days later. That was it was three days later. Gotcha. See, I, I ain't really go because I know I ain't go I ain't go like right then and there. I ain't go she I think she erred in telling you, no offense, but if I know for a fact, if I tell you it's raining outside, I know it's going to be in the media in three minutes. I know it. There's no, no, no tea, no shade. That's just but it truth. wasn't, though. But it wasn't. I ain't going until it like three days. Yeah. You get, a, you get a pat on the back because it took you three days. It took me three so, days. So congratulations. You're doing much better than it used to be. Um, so, shake, okay. I changed. Shake, shake. I changed. I see. And you're doing good. I'm proud of you. you so, all right. Did you change your mind? So. Yeah, applause. Correct. That's how I got in it. Wait, look. I let me address. Got in it, but correct. That's how I. Got in it. Correct. That's how I got in it. Did, at any point in time that you advised her to contact the police, to, for this, and and if so, did you advise her to contact the police? And was it more for to mitigate the situation between what could possibly happen? Because this is serious shit. If she goes to the police, they're gonna arrest her. They arrest them. It's not a question. They're gonna arrest them. They're gonna arrest first and ask questions later. There's, I mean, they have to. Do that. If but, she, well, no, listen, you gotta make. If I was a manipulator, well, he ripped her shirt off. She had scratches on her. If you had scratches all on you, he you ripped your shirt off. Why you take pictures of it? Right. Well, here you go. You ready for this? If I was a manipulator, okay. if I did. Hold on. Let's listen real quick. If I was a manipulator and if I couldn't stay afraid that much, then guess what? The police would have been caught. Think about it. Because I would have been like, if you ain't going to call him, I'm going to fucking call him. You see, I could have like get the and everything. You see, I could have did all that. But that ain't going to show you that I wasn't in my feelings about that shit. I wanted it to be the address. So I did the right thing and said, Fred, call her. I don't know why people say. I think she came to you first because she wants you and Fred to beef. He called her. But, but, okay. but we didn't beef. But we didn't beef because I did the right. I but took see, the right way out. What you happened what I'm with, saying? What, what happened with the... What happened with the situation? Shake it, shake it. Let me ask you this, shake it while we here. While we here, shake it. Uh, and, and please just give me this. Just give me this. You ain't, you ain't, uh, oh boy, don't mess around no more, right? But however, he called you and said, no, you got to just get real quick. Just put yourself in my, if he called you and said, if he called you and said somebody tried to rape him, what would be your next move? Um, me as a victim of rape myself, uh, I, I would, I would, first it's him. 
I want to get him to a comfortable zone and a comfortable space. Head watch. That's there what we I go. Want. Thank you. Yep. I, I go ahead. You, you, you're, you're in a couple of mindset, first of all. Um, and then I will also then delegate this to something that's higher than me. As far as like saying, like, I don't have the, as, as I just know you need to be comfortable. I need you to, all you first are safe. I want to make sure that if you're not, I would do what I can to put you in a safe place physically and mentally. Like, I know you, uh, going through that, you go through feelings of suicide, you go through feelings of self hatred, you go through a, 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 a period of, 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 of depression, anger. It's a lot of emotions that you're feeling at one time. And so, um, and just, just, a, just remember, it's a plethora of emotions. And so, from the from an outside door, and thankfully nobody has called me with that, as far as what is concerned. But I would definitely try to uh, immediately comfort them and put them in a comfortable space because they're going through a a, a wave of emotions. At that time, I would try to seek somebody that's smarter than me because I'm not smart. Uh, I'm smart enough to know that I don't know what to do, and so I will direct them into something. Google's a motherfucker. Baby, what's the? There's a line for this. There's a line for that. There's a place where we can go to tell you what to do with it. And so that's what I would do. I mean, me personally. I would go to immediate what's going on mode. Let me find out what's happening. I, and I think that's what you did at that point. But um, I, I think, though, so I don't know what happened, but I think she needs somebody that is going to believe her. And I guess it's her mother, but. Um, and, but, 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 you ready? Oh, now you ready? You ready? And remember, remember I used to say her mama? And then what did she tell me? She didn't want to tell her mom. She didn't want to tell her mom. And that's what See that? See, so I was dead on. Listen to me. I went to school for this shit. I was dead on. But listen to me, Jake. It, it wasn't until the story started to change. See, if, if somebody tells you something and then it starts to change, Jake, it, it, it's going to fuck with you because you're like, hold on, you want me to help you? If you want me to help you, tell me the whole truth. And then we can go from there. You see, so if they're not telling you the whole truth, then you go back against the wall because you're like, how can I deal with it? So what I did was, since I ain't got the whole two, let me tell him to call, and then boom, the two will come out. You see what I'm saying? So I ain't shade him, I ain't do none of that, I did the right thing. And then after I talked to him, I called Ro. And when I talked to Ro, Ro told me what happened. Did Ro's story con go with hers or against her? Ro me. The only thing she said was, no, listen. Huh? Listen to me. Look what Rose said. Rose said Charlie was down. And let me tell let me tell you about the threesome. You ready for this? Uh uh Shaky? But when the threesome, if 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 everybody agree, and I do I do I have I've been having some good ones, all right? When everybody agree, we all go in. I gotta I, let me come on, give me my pat on my shoulder. You just come on, don't shame me. I'm giving you the truth real quick. So listen, if everybody agrees, then we know what the consequences are. You feel what I'm saying? We know. If we gonna rob a bank, we gonna do anything, we already know what the consequences are. So with that being said, Rose said they did what they did. She put her pussy in on Charlie's face. She was doing whatever, whatever, whatever. And she said once she got her, Fred said, come here, Charlie. So Rose like, fuck, he, I'm done. Let me go sit in my chair. So Rose said she started smoking her black and mild, minding her business. Fred and Charlie went in the corner. And that's what she said. You feel what I'm saying? And so what I'm saying is the story is together. The only difference is Charlie said it was forced. Rose said Charlie agreed. You see? So if I'm going in there with them and she agreed to that point, whatever happened in, in a corner, I don't know because you agreed to come here. You see? And they had plenty of threesomes where I watched. Uh, when I soon I got me, I went in the bathroom. I went clean myself, came back. You feel what I'm saying? So if I'm in the bathroom and I'm doing me and y'all two doing y'all, then that's what y'all doing because we agreed to this. You see? And so that's where Roma and that Rose said, all us agreed. So whatever they was doing in the corner, then that's what they was doing. Rose was sitting in the chair. She said she was sitting in the rolling chair, the studio chair, minding her business. Not the rolling chair. You see, and and they was even on the phone together, and I was I was right there when they was on the phone, and and look, a Ro apologized. Ro said, "Truly, I'm sorry if he, he came across to you the wrong way, but I didn't know." That's what Ro said. I'm right there. She said, "I'm sorry." She said, "But we all say yay." So I thought you wanted it. You feel what I'm saying? And so my thing is. I'm here both the I can't never be lying. I can get Ro right here. Ro, Ro wanted to tell it last night, but you know what I said? Don't worry about it. You no. feel me? So Ro has not spoken publicly outside of on your live about this since this happened. Nope. Not at all. Nope. Steve Chill, take it to a grave. Ro not like that. Ro ain't, Ro ain't with this. 
So roll, roll, roll. Like, look, we know what we did. We know what we signed up for. Let's just, let's just do away with it. Okay. You feel what I'm saying? And that's where it was at. So at this point, you are of the position that Fred did not do anything that's illegal or unethical. He may have been a little touchy or something. A little rough. A little rough, maybe. But it was in a race. But do you not, so at this point, you do not think he did anything illegal or immoral or unethical? I just feel like he did I don't, appreciate it. I don't. I, I, I wasn't against him. Okay. So the next I was, part When I saw the messages, well, listen, listen to me. When I saw the messages, she agreed. Now, when she said no, now, I, look, no is no. No is no. But as far as her going up there and everything, I even told him. I said, homie, I said, ain't got nothing against that. She said, yeah, that was that. Was that. You feel what I'm saying? Right. And so all leading up to that point, I was good. You did, but she kept saying her, her dude didn't want to answer the phone and this and that. So, you know. So, okay. The next part about this happens between Trelly and Ro. You and Ro, are y'all back together? Would you consider y'all back together? Are y'all chilling? No. What's going on? We're just chilling. Okay. We're not back together. So, so, so does Trelly not like that for some reason? Yeah, she don't like that. Well, you got to think about this. Before Ro came by my house, Trelly was always popping up. But gotcha. now, this time when she popped up, she caught me and Ro in the bed naked. Like, yeah. we didn't even know she came. Like, I my wish phone I was, was on, on the phone. My phone, my phone was on silent. <laughs> so I ain't never knew she was calling. So not only, not, what's that here? My brother. Look, not only, not only did she get in the house, she got in the room though. I heard she, she climbed through the window. And when she when she opened the room door, her eyes she just was like, she was just shocked. She just was shocked, and she said, "Bitch, I know you lying." She <laughs> said, "You, I know, bitch, you just said you ain't fucking with Ro no more." So she went to telling Ro, "This nigga just said," and then she tried to hit Ro, and then I grabbed her. You feel what I'm saying? And then when I grabbed her. She said, I can't believe you with this bitch. You, why you? And started swinging on me or whatever. You feel what I'm saying? And then all the while, boom. Then we started talking. You feel me? So she went to telling Ro some more shit. You know, they went to talking it out. But then it came about why why Ro here. You feel me? That's what it became about. Why I Ro there. You know what I mean? So for a while, that's all. A good hour. That's all we've been talking. And she kept trying to fight me. It's all day. Cause bitch, you ain't nothing but a dog. I, you always going back to your fucking baby mama. You, you know, she keeps saying all that. And so I kept saying, but look, Charlie, you said you got a nigga. You know what I mean? And it's this God on too. I say, Charlie, you got a nigga. Why is it? Why it matter if I'm with Ro? You feel what I'm saying? So then, boom, Charlie called about three different dudes. So me and Ro, like, damn, we thought we thought you fuck with one dude. You feel me? But then one dude said, oh yeah, well you know. He a fucking dead beat. And I'm like, wait, why are the niggas speaking on me? This this me and both my baby mamas. You feel what I'm saying? And so, and then guess what? And at that point, at that point, I still didn't put Ro on them. See how they keep saying I made this about Ro and I try to make fun of that? Charlie walked in on that. You feel what I'm saying? And they say, you get what you're looking for. All right, you ready for this? I'm ready. Just the day. Yesterday, Charlie popped up again. She didn't know Ro was there again. She tried to oh, come in my wait. house. Girl, he hanging off the side of the bridge. Girl, what's going on? Tell him jump. No. No, it's the truck hanging off the side of the bridge. So listen, listen. What exit this is? Cam Street. Cam Street exit. So listen. Whew. Why, if Trelly don't want, Trelly don't, Trelly has, has, has stated publicly many times that you just have been with that and she don't want you to know. This is what she stated publicly. So he's being Do you, so you believe that's untrue? Oh, that's untrue. She loved me. She loved me. She only speaking. She only mad. Think about it. Today, today I haven't doing, we, we, I ain't doing nothing wrong. But she talking about me bad. That's because Ro here. But other than that, other than that, Ro loved me. Trelly loved me. Trelly loved me, man. Trelly telling that to y'all. But Charlie know is the lot of shit we were talking about. Charlie say, I'm sleeping by you. You need to put Ro out. Put her out. Said, you going to do it my way or you going to do it your way? You feel what I'm saying? And that's what, I, what I'm lying for. What I'm going to get out of the line? I ain't got to lie. I don't owe y'all no explanation. So if Charlie was the type of person that has had openly, has had relations sexually with Ro before, um, admittedly on both of those, stuff, why would she feel jealous now? Why would she have some, like, okay, we've all had 
sexual relations in some capacity before, whether it be with you, with Fred, or whoever y'all had sexual relations with before. Why why do you think she's jealous now? Like why does it feel some type of way now? Like why not? Because I told her we all just come over. I told her because I told her I never fuck with Raw again. Oh. And that was a lie. At the time, that's how I felt. That's how I felt at the time. Okay. That's what I told her. And that's what she said when she came in. She said, he said he'll never fuck with you again. I know y'all are fucking lying. You know what I mean? And and that and that, that's what that. We need to take this to Jerry Springer. Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. I don't think I don't, this might be above Jerry Springer. This might need to go to Maury. Steve Rocco. Steve Rocco. <laughs> this might be above Jerry. This might be some little, kind of chunk, maybe. I don't know. Okay. So, um, okay. <laughs> All right. So I, I was being funny. But listen, Girl, so I have a question. Amen. So you say, you, you, is, your, is, your, is, is your position that, boom, why am I running to all this fucking traffic everywhere? Like, what the fuck? Mm. Be late for my fucking they got a, the bike thing down. Oh, Listen, I got I got two little questions. I got something for you real quick. Shaky, you ready for this, Shaky? Yes. Listen, what, why, why, okay, today, for three hours, Charlie was talking down on Buck. Yes. Why was she talking down on me? Because. So she want Buck well, back and Buck don't want her back? Because. And Buck went uh, wrong. Because I, I, I mean, oh. I mean, she has a, a plastic of reasons. Maybe because you were the one who broke the story, the, the story about this personal, private issues to social media. Maybe it's this going on. Maybe she sees you. She, maybe brought, it, she brought it to. She brought it yesterday, though, baby. I ain't see brought that to this yesterday. You mm -hmm. feel me? So you ready for the second part? You ready for the second part? Do you think Trella still love me? So I think Trella still loves you. I don't think Trella, Trella has the capacity to. I think Trella needs to find out who she is. I think she still loves you. She cut up that bag when she, she came to your house. I think she's. I don't think Trella loves herself. Oh, damn. I, I think, think she just was in love with the bundles. And and you know I don't know Trella. I don't. You know I don't know Trella. I think Trella is mentally has some mental issues, and she needs to. I think Trella needs to seek help and try and learn herself first. Damn, seek help. So I don't think Trella ever had the capacity to truly understand what love is on that level. That's just my opinion. I'm on the outside looking in. Um, I just think that Trelly should, um, I, this is, and this is not me saying, people think I'm shitting on her. I don't like some of the things she says. She spoke on my child one time and I didn't appreciate that. But at the same time, this is just from a person to a person. Because I go to, I go seek help. I go seek help with shit that happened with me. So I'm telling her, I think she needs to go talk to somebody because I think she has some type of something. So do she love you? I think she has, as she has. I think she loved your situation. This is me, honestly. I think you provided for her. You made everything sure she was all right. You made sure she had this, made sure she had that. You made sure she was good on those levels, made sure she had some type of business going, things like that. And so she loved that comfort. She loved that 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 convenience. You 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 in that case. Do I think she loved you as a person? I'm not sure because I don't know if the child loved herself. She's a child. Damn. That's, Damn. Just, that's what it is. That's you made, that, that's just my, you asked, I'm, a, I'm just being real. That's my opinion. Um, I'm not a doctor. I didn't go to school for this. I just know people. And so if I think that Trelly needs to... So I, do I think she has love for you? Yes, I do believe that. There's, and there's this thank you, Barbara Walters. <laughs> she has... Y'all have a child together. And I think that she has... But as the capacity to be in love with you, I think that this is what it is. This is like... And not saying she's childish, but saying that she is young. So she sees... I wish well, she is childish. But um, <laughs> I'm saying that, okay... This is a when I was with Buck, my life was great. I didn't have to do nothing but just get up and be dressed. Now right. that I don't have Buck, I have to get up and work and do this and talk to this. Whatever I, I do for money, whatever she do for money, however she hustle, I got to do this. I couldn't maintain. Buck was maintenance. Buck was security. Buck was comfort. And so this is what it is. So now I got to get up and work hard. But then, so the analogy is any woman that messes with you has this comfort, has this, has this this level of maintenance so if she sees Ro doing it and you told her well don't worry Ro will never get this again and you she sees that Ro okay Ro she's stable I don't Ro because stable she, not saying Ro needs to I'm just saying like oh well this is a, 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 a maintenance that you promise will never be for nobody else than me so I would act up on this from that part of it so as far as her being in love with you I don't think Trina has ever been in love with anyone because I don't think Trelly truly loves herself. And I only think she don't love herself because I don't even think she knows herself. What is her identity outside of you? 
All right. You all right? Preach, brother, preach. People know. That's a sister, not a brother. <laughs> yes, I'm a sister. <laughs> oh, my, my, bad, <laughs> my bad. You're saying in the plea. Yeah, you're right, sis. My bad. So, um, yes. So, I mean, in, in any respect, like, what is a per when? And the one time she did try to get a personal identity outside of you, it failed. Like, if you said to me, she don't sell hair no more. She don't have a hustle no more. I was, you know, she don't have a hair products and none of it. Whatever she was doing, I don't have any of this. So, my personal identity definitely comes through. But now, this is a, now this is bad on both of y'all. Or you both y'all now. Number one, when you start messing with her at a younger age, it, you 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 took on responsibilities that you didn't have a responsibility to show her how to maintain. Should there not be a you and her? That's on you. You're grown and you should know that. On her too, it becomes uh, um. They said she's still selling hair. I thought she was still selling hair. I don't know if she's selling. I don't know. I don't buy hair, so I don't know whether she's selling or not. She works good, good thing. But this is something she didn't have to do when she was with us. She didn't have to work a traditional job. She had to get up and stand up. That's what she had to do. Oh, uh, hair products. I don't want to move <laughs> So when it comes down to the come down, I mean, all the problems. Oh, she not people not getting their hair. People getting the wrong hair. All that stuff. Like all that happens soon as Buck. So, but Buck never gave her the utensils to say whatever, whatever. So I think that, that the, you and the the Buck trailer relationship was at root based on a toxicity of ill knowledge and that is ill knowledge of self from her friend, and ill knowledge of you for for let like letting her you brain it trailer in you and when you're not there whatever i think also too that you have a penchant of doing this you have a picture of using this huh oh my god it's a big old thing oh uh, excuse me <laughs> this is a big cock in my face hey <laughs> shake it, watch your mouth i'm saved oh child <laughs> you're not saved bro. <laughs> In my Rick Ross voice, um, but no, okay. So, the, the, but you have a pension of doing this. You know, you know, you have given Trelly uh, everything when it comes to something. You know, you have is very. Pretty. You have given Trelly uh, everything when it comes to something. You have given her everything, 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 and so you use this to your advantage to make ensure that she always knows this and is a reminder of this. She can't let go of the. The, the life that you, she cannot let go of the the awkward and she can't let go of the buckster. love that she has for you because you won't let her because you will remind her of it every chance you get. Even being in the road, that's a constant reminder of like, damn, I used to be sitting up there laid up with, uh, um, with, uh, um, hold on, man, I'm trying to cross that. So, um, you, you used to be, I mean, I, that used to be me laid up. This used to be me with these benefits of, 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 of being a matriarch in a sense. So with that being said, so this is, I think this is what you should do. And, 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 and the person that she, um, the person that she ran to, or the person that she began to tell somebody something to when something like this, if she, if this truly happened to her, was you, you, that's, is that you set that up for her to not set it up for, for the set it up to set it up, but set it up for her to like, who else she going to go to? So I mean, I think that, I think that it comes down to this: if you love her, what you do, and I'm not even gonna ask you because I know what you know. Whatever, all 700 people on this live know. You need to allow her to grow up without you, find herself without you. And if you love her truthfully, I think that you need to bring her. She probably will never go, but I think you need to bring her to talk to somebody professional. Because and there's nothing wrong with that, but she probably won't go. I don't know because people think they're great. I need to put her in a motherfucking but, nursery. Not a nursery, but just I mean, I think she needs to talk to somebody so she could understand the mechanics of of just maintaining life. And because guess what, but y'all relationship is toxic for both of you. You've been to jail. Listen to me. She's I left been... it alone though. Why we? Why we? That's what I'm saying. I too much strong. I left this shit alone, and I just like two two just said. I've been chilling. I was drug. I they drug me in this shit today. I was chilling, shaking. Me and you had a conversation yesterday in the play. You saw how how upbeat I was, how business and focused I was. You feel you, me? You saw the difference. You so, cursed me out last night, Buck. But see, so yeah, I saw you. I saw your little duck game. But listen you, to me though, for real. You cursed me, me out when you was on live though. You sugar cane, I had to. Bill Hope. Yeah, yeah. All right, all right. I'm gonna say that for later. Just, just be, just be ready for it. <laughs> so look, but listen, you said, okay, you was doing nothing, you was chilling, you was doing nothing. 
But because of how y'all, because of how y'all relationship was initially founded, how it's set up now, and how it's structured, no matter what occurs with either one of y'all, one time when we was when we had our issue, a girl, I was, you know, this girl was trying to do this and all this stuff like that. Trelly came flying; it had nothing to do with. This don't have nothing to do with you. Nothing. Nothing. This has absolutely positively nothing to do with you. But guess what? Because of how y'all relationship is and how y'all structured and how y'all set up, you are automatically drawn. Automatic. With all. I see that. Because every time she beat, I always get in this shit. Okay. So, I mean, so I think that if, you, if she loves you, you love her. Bring her to see somebody so she can understand herself. You love me. And that's the that's at, at root. because that, that. there's nothing. Instagram will not fix y'all problems. But get what? Shake it. I'm I'm I'm, I'm, I'm happy. I'm happy. But look, I'm happy the way it is right now, though. I'm good. You are. You are. I'm happy. Listen, listen. My kids in there. Roy in there. We cook, you know, we do things. Like, so it's, it's, I, I like this. What do you We're not in a relationship. We're not in a relationship, but I like this. But it's, what happens too, though, when the, it, when, when, what happens then when the children are affected? That affects them. What happens? No, that I'm, I'm telling we ain't talking about the children. We're talking about me, my right. feeling, and that I'm happy that we're all together. Like, you know, we, but, we, 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 and, and, and guess what's going to happen next time? Something happens with Trelly, you're gonna be in. Guess what happens? Some next time something happens with you, you're gonna be in. But what, at what point they're gonna stop putting me in it though? Never until y'all truly let go. Cause y'all let both, go. I'm not telling them nothing no more. You y'all both have issues that y'all need to mitigate. I really think that's. I really believe that. Man, listen, I'm good. Roll, roll over here. It is 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 off the chain. Is man. Roe, it, you and Ro gonna go together? Is, Ro, is that gonna be a perpetual thing? Is you and Ro gonna be? Is you and Ro? Is Ro gonna be over there forever? No, no she's not gonna be over there forever. Exactly. So there's gonna be a point. There's gonna be stuff that happens. There's gonna be stuff that's occur. Life is gonna. We all. One thing we all got to do. We gotta keep living. We gotta keep getting up. We gotta keep going. Get it. We gotta keep going to work. We gotta keep going to do whatever. We have to keep living. New Orleans is so small. Y'all are gonna run in there. Y'all gonna be in stuff. There's gonna be stuff. You're going to see these people. They're gonna see you. It's not. The, New Orleans that's gonna be that. That's gonna be. You can't avoid them. They can't avoid you. You can't avoid what she got going on. She can't avoid what you got going. On. It's impossible. The only way to do it is to face the head on. Not say, oh, I'm glad. That, I'm glad I ain't got nothing to do with it now. And then and stay whatever. But we guess what? You have everything to do with it because of how it was. Because of the the issues that you've done prior. So now it's time to address it. Now it's time to address it. Address it now. Love her. Drag her in. Y'all go talk. Have some family counseling. Have some, some type of stuff like that. Y'all. what I did wrong. What I did Why is it about me, though? What I did wrong. Initially, how you structured your life. to yourself. <laughs> Initially, how you structured your life. That's what you did wrong. Listen. How you structured your life. You created Trent. Monster. The, the monster that Trent is now. Mm -hmm. You created that monster. That is your creation. You put that dick in her back. You unleashed this on us <laughs> several years ago. <laughs> While I was sitting up in the jailhouse, you were unleashing this <laughs> upon us. And now it's affecting a lot of people. And so what happens is, because right now, this what you have created, it affected your freedom, it affected your good name. It affect, it's, it's, it's about to affect this man. If if I if she really did go to the police, I don't know. I, I'm a, I call my connect, but it's Friday and it was. I think it was off. Yeah, but, but what happens is now. I could if, if 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 she did go to the police, guess what? This affects Frey. This affects his family. It affects his relationships. Guess what? It affects you, bro. Y'all out, out relationships y'all having. Y'all future. It affects so much. So guess what? You have to fix it. Fix it. 